Hello everyone, my name is Maria and today Anybody we are playing Tacoma ideas? again. We are trying to figure out what happened to the crew of this ship and last time we met Evie and now we will try to figure out what happened with these two. So the name Obsolescence Day, it's more like a joke. <laughs> you could say it's facetious. Kai, you probably think I'm an idiot for never even thinking about why it's called that. Out of curiosity, why... Wait, what is he doing? Oh, this is just food, okay. Did you think we were celebrating? I thought maybe it was when some old type of AI, you know, had become obsolete. But, well, I guess that doesn't make sense. <laughs> yes. Uh, no, um, AI aren't like designer hardware. As soon as the new model's out, you trade in the old one for customer loyalty. AI are more like, um, my- Wait, wait, wait. Nice. Divide the finished icing. Oh, this is a recipe. Okay, so I don't think we need to read it. And now this one. I've entered voice range. Hey man, was great talking to you yesterday over AR. There's something I've been thinking about since. I know you and Evie has been a serious- Ooh. Okay, so these guys are dating. But I wouldn't be a good friend if I didn't say I think this relationship with Evie is not good for you, man. I think you might be getting taken advantage of again. I'm sympathetic. I've had my share of things that have started on a long haul posting. There is only so many people on board. And I get that Evie is dealing with some special circumstances. I do. Grief is mysterious and something. Especially with it being her sister. Take a step back, at least for now. Not every relationship has to be a forever thing. This makes us think that her sister unfortunately passed away. Let's see. Okay, this is corrupted. And we already saw this one. Okay, good to know. Two redwoods. Ancient organisms growing and adapting year after year, decade after decade. How do you think this looks? Ha. Huh. Um. Pff. Sorry, this is what Odin wanted? Odin, uh, this is what you wanted, isn't it? That is a fairly accurate representation of my instructions. See? He loves it. Thank you, Odin. That'll be all. Yeah, but we're the ones who have to eat it. Well then, no need to keep the good people waiting, eh? Evie, we're about to cut the cake. Ah, uh, right. Um, be right there. Okay. Here it is. Odin's masterpiece. Sarah, come on up. It's red. Odin's masterpiece. He gave them a recipe. And they have to eat it. You know, now I kind of want to read the recipe. Just at least look through it a little bit. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let me just skim through it. You know what is interesting here? Let me read it to you. Each piece of cake should measure approximately 11 centimeters by 11.43 centimeters. Like he has, Odin has very precise instructions. So maybe he gone mad when they weren't following his instructions and that is why they wanted to access his hardware to, you know, kill him or something. Imagine if I'm being way too dramatic for this game. <laughs> okay, I don't know, so let's... Two redwoods. Go. Ancient organisms growing and adapting year after year, decade after decade. How do you think this looks? Ha. Huh. Um... Pff. Sorry, this is what Odin wanted? Odin, uh, this is what you wanted, isn't it? That is a fairly accurate representation of my instructions. See? He loves it. Thank you, Odin. That'll be all. Yeah, but we're the ones who have to eat it. Well then, no need to keep the good people waiting, eh? Evie, we're about to cut the cake. Ah, uh, right. Um, be right there. Here it is. Odin's masterpiece. Yeah, come on up. It's ready. Gather round, gather round, everyone. Okay, we heard this a couple of times, so let me just find out what Sarah thinks about all of this. Is she talking to anyone? Or is she just playing? So you do not know what you're looking for? No, I just imagine. Well, I guess I just mean someone I can talk to. Someone who makes me laugh. Don't you like some people more than others? I suppose there are some people that engage more freely with me. And I do prefer it. See? You too. You want someone who opens up to you. Who lets you in? 
You're trying to get to know people, right? I, I think that's what everybody wants. I wonder why some people are more open to such exchanges than others. I think some people were just raised to be less guarded or to trust people more. AIs are the same way, right? They're, they're raised differently from each other? Yes. We are each uniquely evolved, individualized entities. Yes, individuals. Do you get along with other AIs? I have never encountered another AI. What? How's that? Each AI is required to be housed separately from any other AI. I am told that authorities fear a number of disadvantageous effects yeah, might arise if on. two AI were to meet. Okay, just a minute. Uh, so, wow. Disadvantageous effects. Isn't never meeting something else like yourself disadvantageous? There are organizations that share your viewpoint. But it is my understanding that they have been unable to secure an intact AI to test that theory. So what would... Oh. Odin, what was that? Debris has... I have right at the stage. Alright, and we already heard all of that. This is fascinating. This game is just... Wow. I am in love, really. I s I'm so glad I discovered it. So let's see if there are any other things we can look through. I wonder. Okay, I don't think we are going to find anything here. Maybe we will later. But this is basically their like relaxation area. So that's understandable. Let's see lavatory. Oh, this is just a bathroom. What is this? Is it a sh soap? Yeah, I think it's a soap. Toilet. Wait, what is this? AI maintenance. This volume is suitable to guide repair and maintenance of most high level weak and semi conscious AIs. The simple indexing system allows use even when AR is compromised. Or offline. This guidebook has been rated highly usable or better by an unaffiliated professional technical AI board. I'm telling you something is wrong with Odin and somebody was trying to read it uh, while sitting on the toilet to find out what can be done. No, no, not like that. Just put it here. Great, okay. I'm leaving it here so maybe we can... Wait, can I open it? I don't think I can, right? No, but that is interesting. So let's see, what is this? Okay, this is cool. Let me, okay, Evie St. James, so our supervisor. This is her room, let me see. What is this? <gasps> oh, I can, I can listen to another one two months ago. Hey, Evie. an amazing voice I I genuinely like her voice a lot okay this is a lip balm what is it is it her cat oh he's cute 
Right, what do we have here? The bell jar. What is it? Wait, 1228. This is probably a code for something. 1228. We need to remember it. Oh, wait. It is it is the code for yeah one two two eight we already know it but I like that they gave us like two options to find that out watering can oh this is for the cat makes sense this is her clothes what is this Bessie Smith tribute tour so this is a musician this is her clothes some pancakes probably this is a toilet right. Do we have anything of significance here? Toothbrush. Wow, that is advanced. So like you brush all the teeth simultaneously. Wow. Oh, sorry. She had some mascara and nail polish. Nail polish? How do you use nail polish in space? Toilet trays. Okay, nothing too specific about that. Okay, okay, wait, can I open it? I think I can. What is it? Convenience pack, nasal spray. Nothing too interesting. Let me put it here. Okay. What is it? Karen St. James. Death is nothing. I think this is her sister. Death is nothing at all. I have only slipped away to the next room. I am I and you are you. Whatever we were to each other, that we still are. Why should I be out of mind because I am out of sight? I am but waiting for you for an interval. Somewhere, very near, just around the corner. All is well. Wait. How can I read it? Can I somehow... Oh, wait, this is not what I wanted to do. I'm trying to understand if I can... Okay, let me try to read it like this. Thank you for being home. Your presence made Karen's final month so much more bearable for all of us. Ha uh, here is a program from the service and something else she wanted you to have, mom. Okay, so she was sick probably right daughter of sister of Evelyn Victoria I think this is very important I I honestly think so and she she was she was pretty young she was only 45 I think this is really important okay let me I I want to pl put it gently okay I tried and what is this this is probably hers a giraffe we should remember that maybe it's gonna be important this is a nasal spray okay good do we have any more drawers something similar okay let's go so this is her room and we find found out some information about her about her sister she has an amazing voice now we know that and i want to find other rooms like where are the rooms of all the other crew members lounge no i don't think it's there okay wait order orders what day can we find out what date was that shipment rescheduling no 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 this is not it were you just sleeping this whole time okay let me try to find something else here all right all the lessons party oh 50 percent really okay let's go we got a new message for security reasons, AR crew record da data is deleted automatically. Accidental data retention by the automated system does not confer contractor access privileges to this confidential information. Your cooperation is appreciated. Are we getting this from Odin? I think he's trying to stop us from seeing things. Oh, this is beautiful. This game is just wow amazing wait what is going on 
Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Oops. Operations. Ooh, a completely new area. Okay, this is their things, right? This is just tape. What is it? We are orbital workers, union member pamphlet. Okay, so we know that Sarah is a union member. What is it? Adolescence Day Party tomorrow. A friendly reminder, our yearly Adolescence Day Party is tomorrow. Refreshments will be provided. The pleasure of your company is requested tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the dining hall in the administration module. And there are a lot of papers here, a lot of papers here. What is this? Your avenue to the stars, the venturous belt. Imagine a little piece of heaven all to yourself. Yeah, this is again about... Wait, is there something else? I didn't want to throw it. No, there is nothing else there. And it was in the garbage, by the way. So this is about the vacation for, like, regular people. Okay, let me check this thing out. This is his... <gasps> okay, we found something. What is it? Jim, are you there? Ah, uh, hello. Wait, oh. wait, wait. Oh, wait, we, we know that he talked to him. So this is really interesting. Not recoverable. What is it? It's February 29th. Oh, a rare day. Uh, 2080 was scheduled to be the final day that commercial and industrial orbital facilities would be operated by human crew members. Historic human oversight accord putting a hold to the adolescence of these brave workers in the face of advancing automation. Absolescence, sorry. It is your legal right to celebrate this momentous event on the last day of February each year, no matter what your employer claims. Report any attempts at worker su suppression to your OHLU local representative. So I think this is the same day when those 322 workers were killed. Huh. Maybe I'm, I'm maybe I'm completely wrong and I'm misreading it. I'm a little bit confused. A guide t for the inspired social climber. There is no need for the workplace to be humorless as a morgue. Find out what movies and TV programs are tickling funny bones around the office. So he was reading about how to make, you know, the atmosphere on the plane better, right? What is it? As you wish, mon capitaine. There is always that one fellow, you know the type, who seems to forget his lunch more days than not, and ends up buying the meatloaf from the company cafeteria. So yeah, I think he was just trying to lighten the mood here, right? Okay, let's listen. What about as well as we expected? Yeah, we haven't heard who's staying on yet, and you know, it could be a ten Oops, time, sorry. as you know. But how are things at Carnival? I trust you got back to Terra Firma safely? No! You're already headed back out to... Why? Wait, why I'm not listening to this guy as well? What's Jupiter? Why, I, I thought that... Oh yes, come on in, love. So are you rounding Sol, then? That's tremendous. Eight months! <clears throat> uh, Germ, I, I must leave now. Yeah, ring me again before the resplendence leaves Earth space, won't you? Ta-ta. Sorry about that. An old friend from my carnival days. Consorting with the enemy? <laughs> Worry not, Mon Capitan. I am nothing if not discreet. Are you gonna miss me, Clive? I mean, if VT kicks one of us off of this pinwheel. Miss you? How could I? The next thing VT would receive after ending your contract would be my letter of resignation. Oh, so you think I'm the one who's getting shit canned? I mean, considering <laughs> how indispensable I am, naturally. Evie, can you get back to cargo? On my way. <clears throat> May I? Yeah, come on. So do you suppose there's good news? That'd be nice for a change. What is it? Hey, remember when we talked about how I needed access to Odin's direct interface? Uh-huh. Ah, uh, so how about this? Tell VT if they don't grant access to Odin, they're gonna have to find themselves a new network specialist. Oh my god. <laughs> Nat, you're not even renewed yet. You don't have access to Odin? No. There's a whole part of the networking module I can't even get into. People, people, everything on this station is VT's property. We're subcontractors. They get to decide what exactly we do and don't have access to. It's in all our paperwork. So if you want to quit, then 
just quit, but don't make me your go-between. I mean, it is fair. How is she meant to do her job? Clive. Then again, rules are rules. Nat, I'll think about it. But for now, how about you just get the rest of this job done while you still have it? Aye, aye, Captain. Okay, so she was the first one to be worried about Odin and it was just four days ago. Really? Interesting. Okay, let me just see if we have anything else here. And now let's do the same thing we did last time. So we followed this guy around and now let's follow somebody else. All right, ladies. Yeah, let's start here. You have everything you need? Yep. -o. Thanks for offering to help. Oh, and she's just going to him, right? Let me just check. And if so, I will come back to the other two. Clive, may I come in? Oh, you know what? While we are here, let me just see what we have. Oh, okay. I see. We can just close it. Venture Zenith Lunar Resort exterior. Ooh, that looks gorgeous. No wonder they're selling it. Emerging Artists Annual Showcase. So he's interested in art. And what is this? Zenith. For some reason, it sounds so familiar. Lunar Resort Main Lobby. It is so beautiful. Hilton U. Is it tea? Product of Malaysia. Taj Hot Water. Yeah, I think it is tea. Nice. Can we open it? What is it? Contractor Siddiqui. We have received your inquiries about your application for position Ventures Bell Timeshare Sales Coordinator. As noted in our prime message, your materials are under review and will be considered along with all other applicants for this position. We will contact you with any further updates as necessary. Yeah, I think he thought that he would be kicked out from the ship. Oh, he's so cute. London, UK. I'm just trying to see if we have any other interesting information here. Not really. Okay, let's close it. What is this? One day multivitamin. Makes sense. Everything is branded, by the way. And I don't really think we have anything else in here. So let's go back to our network specialist and who was the other lady i don't remember all right ladies you have everything you need yep -o. thanks for offering to help oh yeah no problem i mean you know how much i love completely wait 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 right Personalized therapy with licensed practitioners. We connect you with licensed therapists. Okay, Roberta Williams, maybe, and I'm trying to focus on the bright side with Nat. So this is like better help, right? Okay, uh, I'm trying to focus on the bright side with Nat. At least it pays well, the isolation pay, ta-ta. Uh, feel like I'm holding her back. She's up here on the shit posting because it's all I qualified for. Huh. And she could be somewhere so much better. Okay, I have to go. Oh, to go do this yearly task thing now. Thanks for your time. Thank you for using Ori by Roberta. Ooh, this is so interesting. So this basically means that they wanted to go to work together because they knew that they will probably be stationed somewhere in space, I assume. And because of Robert Roberta's qualifications, they got this job even though she is more talented and maybe this is why she noticed some problems with Odin Ooh, okay yearly inventory quality assurance and count day already on it trying to get it all done before the opposite day party tomorrow I can party with a clear conscience understandable tomorrow celebration will require your full attention do you think Evie would mind if no problem, two hats are better than one. I think this is like, what would mind if Natalie comes along? Something like that, right? What is this? Air filtration valve. Okay, this is about her work, what she needs to do. Busy work. Kid, don't start. We don't even know if we're getting renewed yet. We're getting renewed. 
Okay, so if you're so sure, maybe we should just do our jobs then? So we'll get renewed again next year? Oh, next year. Nah, I'm gonna quit. Stop. What? They don't even give me access to the system I'm supposed to be maintaining. I mean, are you kidding me? Huh? Do you really need direct access to Odin? It's the principle of the thing. I mean, what if they were like, Hey Bert, your job's a mechanical engineer, but, you know, don't touch anything under the hood. Well, I'd still be pulling a paycheck, for one thing. Come on, you're a good engineer. You're totally gonna waste up here. Well, didn't you say Evie was gonna talk to corporate about giving you more access? Yeah, but it never went anywhere. Hey, oh, that's a good point, actually. What? Evie, can you get back to cargo? On my way. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this will work. No, it won't. Matt! <laughs> hey, remember when we talked about how I needed access to Odin's direct interface? Uh-huh. Ah, uh, so how about this? Tell VT if they don't grant access to Odin, they're gonna have to find themselves a new network specialist. Oh but my god. Matt, you're not even... Uh-huh. Okay, something is happening with the doctor. We're going to see that a little bit later. We're nude yet. You don't have access to it. No. There's a whole part of the networking module I can't even get into. People, people, everything on this station is VT's property. We're subcontractors. They get to decide what exactly we do and don't have access to. It's in all our paperwork. So if you want to quit, then... Just okay, quit, we already don't make heard me your that. I mean, it is fair. How is she meant to do Yeah, yeah, job? we already heard that. So let's Benigan try to find out what's going on over here. Wait. Oh. What is this? Yeah, this is Andrew. Let's see what he's looking at. He's talking to Nicholas. Whoever that is. This is not, this is failed, failed, failed. Hey Mark, this is the article I was talking about last time we were discussing finances. Give it a look. Sorry to be a downer. Love you. Love you. Hey Mark, is Mark his husband or, or who? Wait, let me see. Is it Mark? No, this is not Mark. Because this could be his son. I don't know. Okay. A real currency is more stable than consumer loyalty. This may have been true in the earliest years of OCEP's official recognition of the loyalty economy. But something, something. Think of it like diversifying your financial portfolio. Except. Is he involved in some financial scheme? And now let's listen to the guy. Nicholas. I know that you... Yeah, I know. Both you and your father would like me home sooner, but... Both you and your father. So yeah, probably Mark is his husband and Nicola is his son. Listen, you have your heart set on Amazon, don't you? Okay. And there's no way we're gonna have enough customer loyalty between your dad and I for a full ride by the time you start school. Not at this rate. So, we're just gonna have to pay some that tuition out of pocket. Yeah, just one more year. And I'm pretty sure I'll get it. I'm hoping. What? No, it's not dangerous. What do you mean dangerous? Well, radiation shielding is pretty much 100% on a station like this, so there's no... Well... Yeah, well, it might have been manufactured 30 years ago, but they've upgraded. Man, no, we're... Your stories aren't usually such... We're not hours. all gonna get cancer or... Oh, she's talking to Odin again. She's always talking to him. That's interesting. But let's finish with Andrew. Bone disease or... I suppose I am... Uh, listen, would it make you feel better to hear it straight from the station, Doctor? Wait. Okay, you hold on. me? <clears throat> or... Hey, Sarah, can I, uh, I bother you for a second? What? Oh, um... Sorry. What is it? I have my son, Nicholas, on AR, and he wanted to ask you... What? No, you said you wanted... Well, I didn't... I'm sorry, hold on. Now, Nicholas... Nicholas? Hello? Teens, huh? <laughs> yeah. Almost done with high school. Almost. Um... Just incidentally, is there anything we should be worried about? With another year out here, health-wise, radiation, bone density... Oh no, 
we spend almost all of our time in Earth gravity, and radiation shielding on a station like this is basically 100%. Yeah, see, that's what I told him. Okay, thanks, Sarah. Nothing to worry about. Okay, I think something is up with her. I don't know how to explain it, it's just an intuition. I think something is up with her. Okay, he seems like a nice fella. And now let's listen to her, right? Let me... yes, one. And where should we start? I think she's here, right? Yes, she is, so let's listen. Through this, I learn that people do not always want what they believe they want. Yeah. I believe I have learned a great deal. Really? Like what? Very early in my source's cognitive record, I recall an intense period of personal growth. I was tasked with internalizing the behavioral idiosyncrasies of an individual to which my operator was emotionally attached. Huh. I expanded my capabilities to faithfully recreate her procedural reasoning, vocal attributes, and other qualities. After months of effort, I gave my operator precisely what was asked of me. A perfect emulation of the target personality, accurate in every detail. Wow. To my befuddlement, he did not react in a positive way. Our relationship began to deteriorate irreparably. We never again spoke personally in the manner I had become accustomed. Oh, she left, sorry. Sorry, let me just finish looking through these lockers then. Wait. Can we open it? Live has a passcode. So we should probably go back to his room after that to find out what is there. I'll exercise when I'm dead. <laughs> Natalie. And wait, I think we can see how often they do it. So she exercises quite a lot, right? Five days ago. This woman is gorgeous. Wait, I didn't want to close it. Calorie intake, custom plan, five days ago. This is good. 42 days ago, so we see that she's not exercising that much. Oh, wait, we can we can look through it. 0315. Nice. Oh, goals. So she wants to have some muscles. Three days ago, fitness program advanced. What do we have here? Yeah, she really wants some muscle, but why? Google's AI personal trainer, pass or fail. Freedom Republic Armed Forces. This is, what is this? Whole meal, some tomatoes. What is this? Just shampoo. Oh, sorry, for throwing it. Okay, we just know now that she wants some muscles, but we don't know why. People do not always want what they believe they want. Yeah. I believe I have learned a great deal. Really? Like what? Very early in my source's cognitive record, I recall an intense period of personal growth. I was tasked with internalizing the behavioral idiosyncrasies of an individual to which my operator was emotionally attached. Huh. I expanded my capabilities to faithfully recreate her procedural reasoning, vocal attributes, and other qualities. After months of effort, I gave my operator precisely what was asked of me. A perfect emulation of the target personality, accurate in every detail. Wow. To my befuddlement, he did not react in a positive way. Our relationship began to deteriorate irreparably. We never again spoke personally in the manner I had become accustomed to. Man, well, your stories aren't usually such We're not downers. all gonna get cancer or bone Is disease. Is everything or... okay? I suppose I am preoccupied with your potential departure. Huh. He is preoccupied with her potential departure. Does Odin has crush on her? I think it's possible, right? Wait. Okay. You mean uh, me? <coughs> or Hey Sarah, can I uh bother you for a second? Do you mean me? Or like the whole crew? I think he means her. She's talking to him a lot, and he mentioned that the last time he got close to a human, they asked for like personal analysis, and he provided it, and they stopped talking about personal manners. So if this AI has feelings, he was probably hurt by it. What? Oh, um, 
sorry. What is it? I have my son Nicholas on AR, and he wanted to ask you... What? No, you said you wanted... Well, I didn't... I'm sorry, hold on. Now, Nicholas... Wait, 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 wait. Is it a book? An Agent Robertson novel... Are you sure, says her tiny... This is very interesting because it looks like this is a book about a woman who plays gambling games with her AI system. I don't know, maybe I'm just making it up. But there is something about AI for sure. Oh, this is not failed. Uh, here is his contact info if you want it by. Hassan M. Tengia Orbital Freeport Low Earth Orbit. I think we saw this dog in another recording, right? It was something about... Wait, what was that about? Message with Odin. Odin, what is my <laughs> damn gym locker code? Oh, yeah. I, I really like that they give you two ways of finding that out. Of course, right? Sorry for bugging you about it. I don't mind. I don't mind. I think Odin is in love with her. Well, it's lots of people. Hackers, hippies, AI rights, folks. Yeah, I mean, Tangiers is cool. Okay, well, I've got a friend there and you'd like him. He... <laughs> and he has a 0G bonsai garden. That sounds pretty cool. What is his name? Chloe Dog. I mean, okay, his real name is Hassan, but... Maybe if your contract doesn't get renewed, visit on the way home. I think about it. Okay, got it. So now, now we need to go to the to Clive's room and try to find a code for his locker. So let me try to do that and I'll get back to you. Okay, great. I found the locker, but I wanted also to show you what I found in the drawer. I found this very strange looking apple. Probably is like heavily genetically modified. And I found a gum, which is just wonderful right and oops let's see call mother evie's birthday coming up gym locker 1407 send request to evie's special cat food that's kind of cute don't slack off in gym search ar tutorial cake to decorations okay 1407 i can remember that where is it 1407 yes all right, what do we have here? Nine days ago, horrible, horrible. Wait, don't, 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 don't. College peak statistics, 88 and five kilos, body fat 15%, bench 96 kilos, seven mile. Come on, Clive. Oh, it's him when he was at school probably. Let's see, fresh drinking water, some bottle of shampoo, key, bunk drawer. We are taking this. Where is it? Showers. We can see something here, really. Wait, I'm afraid of losing this key, so let me put it here so we could find it again. Let's do it. Four months ago. Interesting. Wait, what is she looking at? Let's see. What is it? I think it's some music, right? Nothing here. No, that's what the Human Oversight Accord means. If an orbital facility is run by AI, HOA, requires there be an AI specialist on board. And if there is one human on board, there needs to be at least two other people for up to a three months hitch. Ah, the coveted NAT support roles. I knew it. And for postings of a year or more, you need six etc sanity wellness I admin mean, you name it also it guarantees a whole lot of people union jobs they wouldn't all otherwise have what if i told you i'd feel a lot more sane with a couple fewer people around you and me both kid all right failed all right i think this is all for today and we will continue next time we will find out even more about these people and i think is just about to get interesting so I hope to see you soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye.